It's in 20 days. 24 days. Can we do, can we do it now? Flash. We can! Look at that. I'm gonna be like this. Look at that. Uh, maybe of the year. We have a Plague Tale. Because, absolutely not. Out of the ring? Probably. Go to War Ragnarok? Probably. Or who's the problem anyways? Absolutely not. Straight? Absolutely not. Xenoblade Chronicles? Absolutely not. Um, Elden Ring or Go to War Ragnarok? I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna give it with the Elden Ring. Um, the game worked well. It was polished. It was ready to go. It had depth. It had anything that you'd think it would have. Um, it had good mechanics. It had new mechanics. It was innovate and it was innovative. It was innovative. Um, Alan Rings wins by action. Uh, you, I would think it'd be close when you got over one Alan Ring. It's not. It's not. Elden Ring wins by an, a pretty big margin. Not if I mean that it's close, it's a big margin. Fucking bitch ass motherfucker. Um, yeah, Elden Ring wins this, chat, I'm sorry. Um, chat, you guys also want to say God of War, and I would agree with you with God of War. I don't think that they, that they, that they innovated and went above and beyond the things that they had already done in a way that Elden Ring the did for the same style of game. Sorry. Is going to make Don't give a fuck anymore. That's why. Because Elden Ring evolved and what and did did things that are more innovative in their style than God of War did for their style and their own franchise. Sorry. Elden Ring wins. Best game direction. I was thinking creative vision and innovation and game direction design. Oh, that's what I just talked about. Fuck. Well, it was still it was still game it was game of the year. Um, I still think Elden Ring wins that. Sorry. In game direction, not stray. I don't agree. I don't agree. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I was expecting more from Stray in terms of delivery of the game's story, in terms of uh, uh, the vision, the design. Don't get me wrong. It was good and it was good. It was and it, it was new. I think it could have been even better. Sorry, bitch ass. Um. Okay. <laughs> Fuck, it's hard though. I love you. Um. Innovation and vision. I <laughs> Elden Ring. Sorry. People say God of War. Maybe, they, maybe the right. I don't give a fuck. I think I still think it's Elden Ring. Sorry, man. Best narrative. Definitely God of War. Definitely God of War. And in, in all of these, for sure. Yeah, God of War. Add a good narrative. I think it's sort of. I think the story we got a little bit clunky because of the bullshit fucking HS arc. You haven't played 90% of the games on the lists, moron. Okay, I'm messing with the chat. I'm messing with the chat. Guys, it's not that I'm glazing, okay? Okay, guys, I feel like, I feel like we didn't get enough story delivery and enough value for the story from the from the Atreus arc than, than you spent a uh, time doing it. The time you spent wasn't uh, 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 justified. Uh, in what you get out of it. That's, that's how I think. Best art direction. Interesting. Interesting. I'm no stray. Technical achievement. Nah, I got a war. Nah, I got a war. Uh, no, 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 no. I, th I thought it was like the, the, the other art category. There's, there's, an there's another art category. I still think I got a war wins. Um, their integration. I'll tell you what, I did my The 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 way that God of War went in and out of cinematics, right? The, tr the transitions and the way they they delivered some of the uh, the animations and is seamless. Robert. You barely know it's happening because they're doing it so well. Okay, when you're playing God of War, they do things that you don't even know are happening. There's like dozens of them. Because it's so well done, and they, they win by a landslide. It's not even close. Best score in music, ooh, dude, ah, uh, dude, uh, dude, Elden Ring wins, uh, dude. God of War went hard. Chat, Elden Ring's music is crazy. Elden Ring's music is crazy. Okay, sorry. 
Um, best auto design. Oh man. Okay, so COD wins. Let me explain. Call of Duty wins this category. Okay, because they have way more layering to do, or whatever you call that. I don't know, mastering, mixing, than God of War. God of War did it crazy good in their audio, and I already said that before, right? Call of Duty have a more on their plate for the type of game for the type of game they have, and they did pretty good considering how much they have to do. Cody wins. Yeah, chat chat doesn't know how, how this works. So. Chat thinks because I play online, I got killed from a guy above, and I thought he was on my left. The audio is bad, bad game. You are cringe. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Okay, there is like. 16 level of audios going at the same time for this shit to run properly and feel good and it's incredibly hard they have mastered it they are good at it and they are they are industry leaders in audio they win fuck you idiot that is what we call a fact when i just said it guys that's a fact Best performance, uh, Horizon, uh, nah. Playtale, nah. This guy wins automatically. Games for impact, for a thought-provoking game with a pro-social meaning or message. Um, I didn't play any of these fucking games. Also, as Dusk's Fall, because it looked decent. I didn't play any of them though. Best ongoing, every year, you, I vote this and chat gets mad. Um, and chat gets mad. I feel like Genshin has been doing a lot for their game. So did Apex. Destiny could have done more. In my opinion, Destiny could have done more, probably, for their game. Um, Fortnite could have done way more for sure. Nah, not Fortnite. Uh, I think Apex might win. For I was saying development of an ongoing content that evolves after experience over time. Best indie game, Saifu or Stray? Saifu or Stray wins this. Cult of the Lamb is okay. It's, it's, um, I'll be honest, probably, si probably Saifu. Because I would say Stray, okay? I think slightly overrated in this field. Sorry. Okay, I think, um, Saifu did crazy, did, did really good for an indie game when it comes down to, um, the feel and the, the delivery of the game. In, in an innovative way. Cypher wins this. I don't give a fuck. Best mobile game. Um, probably... Probably Diablo Immortal. Diablo Immortal. Sorry. I don't give a shit. Diablo Immortal wins that. Diablo Immortal was pretty good. Diablo Immortal was pretty good. I think chat's coping. Best community. You say pay to win fest. And you probably pay to win. That means that the product is good. Because you bought it. Sorry, bitch ass. That's just how it is. If you weren't a stupid consumer, if you weren't a stupid consumer, people would stop making stupid games. Okay? Stop being a stupid consumer, and then things will change. Dumbass. Why did every company have, have, have uh, loot boxes? Because people buy them. Don't like them? Don't buy them. <laughs> Sorry, that's how it works. Best community support. Best community support. <laughs> Recognizing a game for outstanding community support, transparency, and responsiveness, and, and including the social media and game uh, passage updates. Um. No problem, no man. Sky. Chad, did they do well this year again? Individual in the next accessibility. How weird is pushing medium forward, adding features, technology, and content, the games by wider audience? I'm gonna be honest, chat. I'm be honest, Last of Us wins this. Wait, it's part one. Oh, you didn't, they did a lot of innovation with that. God of War, chat, I'm gonna say how it is. If there was a category that said it, that said it, the innovation in accessibility, God of War would win. I think God of War didn't add anything to accessibility. I think they removed accessibility, okay? With the fucking stupid ass shit, okay? Uh, 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 Backseat gaming. PCL. Thank you and, for and everything. Said, it's you are dumb. It's a so dumb. You spend three seconds. Maybe you should try throwing your axe at the wall and see if it freezes the wall. Turn around. You, 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 you didn't even have enough time to think of the next puzzle. 
Wow, that's a tough spot. These, uh, these, these roots, you could probably burn them to go to the next stage. Oh man, shut up. What the fuck is this? Like, man, best VR. Best VR. Best VR. By Bone Lab, I didn't even see though. I, I, I don't know this. Best action game. Give me that from a on combat. Um, Call of Duty or Saifu for its combat aspect. He was in the other one was, was pretty good. In. Combat? Uh, I say Saifu. Combat was pretty dank. Best action adventure game. Action. The best action adventure game. Going combat. Uh, I mean, the Diagon of War 100%. Money line close. Best role playing. Role playing. Elden Ring. Not even close. I don't want to hear it. Best fighting. Okay. Um. Multiverse is pretty dank. Happy 50. How are you doing? It is pretty good, but Cypher is really good too. Uh, I actually like most of it. It's, just, it's a lot of copying, but eh, fuck it. It's such a good though. Best family. Best family. Lego Star Wars. Lego Star Wars. Actually, you played God of War on easy mode. Nintendo Switch Of course, sports. they are going to tell your brain rot ass what to do. No, uh, it's been it's been proven, um, it's been proven by all media outlets that the the backseat gaming is the same across all game modes, and for that you are a dumb fuck and you lost five dollars. Suck on my fucking balls, bitch ass. Best sim strategy. Wait, what? Uh. Probably Victoria 3. I was gonna say Victoria 3, a chance to something. I didn't play the game, I saw a little bit of it. Best sports racing. Best sports racing. Oh, hell not. None of this shit. FIFA. Oh, man. Jesus. Out of spite, I'm voting against Rismo because fuck all them. Minus Best five multiplayer slash. Call of Duty. Content creator of the year. Other games: Ludwig, Nibelian, Nobru, Cutie. Probably Ludwig. Probably Ludwig. Who's Nobru? Who's Nobru? I don't know what Nobru does. I don't know what Carter Games did. Wait, am I crazy? I don't. I don't be disrespectful. Um, 10 months ago, one year ago, bro, are we voting for 2021 or 2022? What the fuck is it? What the fuck are they doing? Guys, I'm not even roasting Carl. I just to his face. I don't give a shit. I, guys, I, I, I like Carl. We hang up, we, I hang up with Carl a lot off stream, okay? I hang out a lot, okay? I mean, he even, he even would agree that across all streamers, YouTubers, where the fuck, last upload 10 months ago, bro. Last year, we uploaded a video, like, all the time. This year, zero videos. What are they doing? What are they doing? I'm confused. It's not I'm defending anybody. Uh, it's fan voted? No, it's not. It's not fan voted, otherwise Cutie wouldn't be there. Um, what's just something about Sonic Omega Balls? That wasn't a joke. Who knows that? Guys, 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 if this was fan voted, it would be, it would be, it would be like, it would be like, Dream, Rambo, Quacky, uh, 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 Carl, fucking Mr. Beast. Also, I think that Mr. Beast should win this. That's my dick, but Mubbuck wins this one for, uh, everybody that's on there. Um, best deep cute ND, uh, uh, ND. Um, everybody's glazing, everybody in chat. I everybody in chat glazing, like, oh my god, the speed shouldn't win this. Oh my god, Cash should win this. Dude, dude, dude. Mr. Beast did like a, a massive amount though. I, I, I think he's like super hardworking. And I think the, the, 
he has both the efforts and the result. It's kind of hard to go against him on that. Sorry. It's hard to go. It's hard. It's hard to go against uh, efforts, result, and scale. He has it all. It's kind of like a, a trifecta. Best debut in D. Vampire Survivors. They really created a new genre almost. I mean, it, they kind of revived the genre and reignited it. That's really hard to do. Guys, they literally, they literally revived a style. Went hard with it and inspired others to do the same. It's one of the craziest things you do, and as an indie company, not easy at all. Best adaptation. We're gonna do the outstanding creative work that Elden probably... Ring is innovative. Dark Souls. Oh, see that's cringe. See, is it because you're a bad gamer, you don't you don't understand what they did past Dark Souls and how much the game has more features and more that are innovative in the Dark Souls genre. You're just you're just uh 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 uh. I'm done. Uh, I could have worn faithfully. Uh, the adaptive video games and another entertainment medium. Um. Dude, Cyberpunk did pretty good with the, with the short, to be honest. Arcane wins this. Arcane did fantastic. Most anticipated game. Um, Starfield, maybe. Legend of Zelda, perhaps. I'm gonna say Zelda. Four best stream ever. Probably Love Zelda. Seven, 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 seven. I would say Hogwarts Legacy, but um, I think coming. From their following, and how much people like, uh, 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 by, by ratio, how many people like Harry Potter, how many, to how many people anticipate Hogwarts, the ratio isn't as dense as people who like Zelda, they're expecting the next game. Sorry, Zelda wins this. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. That's, that's just the truth to get mad at. I, I, I have people want to do. That is what we call the truth. Best esports game. The game that has developed the Obis of all experience. Um. Dota was odd. From the looks of it, Starfield is 10 years out. Dota was odd. I think League could have, gone, could have done better. I think League could have done better. I think CS wins for consistency and how much, how much effort they put in. I think CSGO has been consistently delivering it. Um, the energy of what people want. I don't give a fuck. It's Among like, us sports, so I don't care. Lot. It's cons it's it's constant effort, constant result. It's never ending. They did a lot. I think League in the great of things failed. Sorry, bitch. Let me repeat this for all the fucking League Andes. I'm a League fan. I think League in the grand scheme of things failed, bitch. That's the truth. Done. Nice. NPC opinion. Best esports athlete. Ah, oh, Faker probably. Nah. Nah. Probably simple. I vote simple. That's why I vote. Every year I vote simple. Best esports team. FaZe Clan. Gen G. LA Thieves. Loud. Vote for Pedro. I would vote loud, but I lost a lot of money on gambling for loud. I'm good. I'm not voting loud. Sorry, bro. Maybe next time vote. Uh, maybe next time play properly. Okay, that's out of the way. Uh, what else? Um. Phase. Plan for CSGO. LA Thieves, Call of Duty. League Gen G. Not one. Oh, they did win. Wait, no, wait. Wait, loud. No, fuck it. I I think I mixed them up with the other dudes from the other tournament. That, that it was. That it, dude, I think. No, I vote loud then. Fuck it. Yo, they went hard. Oh, no, hell no. I, I won money with these guys, no? Oh, fuck yeah. Well, I, I won money with these guys. Ain't no way Lil Bro voted for games he was too shit to play or speed ran through. Lil Bro deadass voted for Elden Skip for game of the year. Best esports coach. I don't know any of these guys. I, I can't. Probably this guy, I guess. Best esports event. Evil 22. No. 22 League of Legends World Championship. 22 League of Legends World Championship. PGL Major, no. 
Valorant Champions. Wait, where's TI? Worlds wins for this. Where's TI though? It's Ant. Boom, see there's all my votes. That's Come it. On, I'm this done. is outrageous. You need to react to this with the timestamp link.